Good morning, TK fam. Welcome to today's vlog. I am starting off the vlog with, I just actually ran to Sephora to grab some new makeup products. I needed like just a new beauty blender. I wanted to try this old foundation that I got and I'll just show you really quick. Um, it's this Lancome Tint Idlewear. I used to be obsessed with this and I don't know why I really stopped using it. So I got that again. I got some gift cards for Christmas and it's like the best when you have a gift card and you go to somewhere that you're like that you love it's like the best feeling I got a new beauty blender I swear by using this for applying my makeup and then I saw this which this is so cool because I'm going to a revolve event tomorrow which I will be vlogging at and um it's like Drake's performing on Saturday, Justin Bieber is performing tomorrow on Friday. I think that's the date, or maybe it's swapped, I don't know. <laughs> Something like that. And I'm super excited, and this, I wanna wear my hair up one of the days, and this you can kind of like use to like, um, like style your hair, like when it's pulled up, like either push the baby hairs forward. So it kind of looks like a toothbrush almost, that's what I first thought it was when <laughs> I saw it. And I was like, oh, it's an edge tool. And I was like, this looks so cool. So I'm gonna try to do something cool with that. And then um, I'm actually in line right now to get my car washed because I haven't had my car washed in like two months and it's really dirty. <laughs> so I'm like, we need to go get the car washed. And then I'm gonna just respond to some emails while I sit here. But I'm so sad I forgot to take you guys into Sephora with me. But then I remembered that I don't think they let you film in there anyways. So it worked out better. Um, but I'm excited. I'm gonna do, um, I have a stream today and tomorrow too. And then I'm gonna prep for the weekend. And I'm also doing a like mini Super Bowl party with um, some people at our church and our ward. And so I'm also trying to like get ready for that. And so I'm gonna have to like, get a list of groceries together for Colby to go get at like Trader Joe's because I want to make some of these like fun dips. There's this dip that's so, it's so good from Trader Joe's. It's like a bruschetta type dip with like tomatoes and cheese and all this really good stuff in it and I really want to make that. So I think I'll have him grab that with some like chips and stuff and then I'm just going to be in LA for the whole weekend basically. I'm staying at Colby's cousin's house, Daisy. So I'm staying at her house, which thank goodness so I don't have to drive back and forth because I'm in Orange County and it's like probably like an hour and a half both ways but it'll be nice because the party's from 9 to 2 a.m. so it'll be really nice to not have to drive back at 2 a.m. except for on Saturday I may leave that night I'm not 100% sure yet. I'm not 100% sure yet I may just kind of wait and see how I feel because if I'm super tired then I'll probably just leave early or if it just depends on when Drake's performing really that's like that's the main thing I'm excited for and I also need to um I have to film a campaign with them while I'm there as well. So I'm kind of just like waiting to see how all that unfolds. But I'm still finished st styling some of my outfits that I have. So hopefully that will be solved soon. I gotta move up in line, literally moving like two feet. Um, I'm also like really exhausted because yesterday I went, I ran yesterday and then the day before that I did Pilates and for some reason my body is like so exhausted from it and I'm trying to like not be so tired and I think it's also because it's like 80, let's see, it's 83 degrees outside right now so there's like a huge massive heat wave that came through so I'm kind of feeling a little bit tired from that. So I'm going to try to sleep like nine hours tonight to get really rested and everything but I also got to get all my YouTube videos edited, I got to get lots of TikToks edited, do the streams, make sure that's a good time. I think that's pretty much it for now, but I hope that my, I think my clothes for the event should arrive tomorrow. I'm hoping they arrive today. If they arrive today, I'd be so excited. I have most of the stuff, except for I got this jumpsuit and it was like strapless and I was gonna wear something under it because I don't like wearing anything that's like strapless because it freaks me out. It like gives me anxiety that's gonna just like fall down. And so I was like, I tried it on and I just didn't really like how it looked with something under it. So I got some new pieces. So hopefully I'll be able to figure out a cute look for it, but I'm really excited. Also, I was gonna get my nails done, but at the end of the day, I hate getting my nails done because it takes so long. So that's where we stand with that. But that's a little update. I wanted to do like, I wanna do more talking in my vlogs, like just talking to you guys. Like just when I'm straight out doing random normal day things like I haven't even gotten ready yet today I've, today's kind of been a little bit of a weird day same with yesterday I got my brows done yesterday normally I would be actually getting ready right now but I actually may leave the car wash because this line is really long 
um anyways that's a little update but yeah i want to do more talking in my vlogs just kind of like chat with you guys and if you guys have any sp things specifically that you want to see in the vlogs let me know in the comments below because i would love to know all right tk fam i just got to daisy's house i just drove here this is where i'm staying for the night so all my stuff's just right there um i'm waiting for my uber right now because i did not want to drive there and it's only actually like i think seven minutes away so it's perfect timing i think it's just past 9 15 i'm like a little bit nervous a little anxious i think it's because i haven't been to an event in so long and it's just mostly like a little bit of social anxiety but i'm gonna be fine but i'm gonna get lots of content i think i may even surprise everybody and go live on instagram so when justin is performing tonight so it's gonna be a good time i'm very excited this is my fit though just like this green bodysuit or it's not even a bodysuit but basically some leather pants and then these uh lucky green jordans this is actually my first time wearing them i got them for christmas and i have not worn them yet so woohoo locked myself out of the house that I'm staying at. I went to go grab my food and I locked myself out and it's freaking hot outside. So hopefully I'll be able to get back into this freaking walk room. Dude, I, we're gonna talk about last night. because it was extremely fun. But first I'm gonna figure out how to get back into the house that I just locked myself out of. This is freaking amazing. It's from Earth, Earth Cafe. Does I look like I got hit by a bus? I think that's how I internally feel right now. I went to bed at 5 a.m. I think. Anyways, now off to the bus start. But it's fine. All right, TK fam, it is now Saturday. I'm currently starting the process of getting ready for the second night of the Revolve event. 
um tonight drake is performing i'm so excited i need to get a like some more video footage for um i'm trying to like push down all this stuff from the face mask i need to get some more footage for one of my campaigns that i'm doing with klarna and revolve but i wanted to talk really fast about last night maybe we'll talk more when i'm getting ready um kind of about last night and like kind of what everything that went down um i literally just woke up from a nap i took like a super cold shower and then slept for just like 20 minutes because i was so tired and i feel so much better already i'm gonna like do a little face massager thing on my face just kind of like deep puff <laughs> everywhere um but I'm very excited for tonight. It's gonna be so much fun. Also, this robe is literally my love language. I am way too obsessed with it, way too obsessed. Did I just Postmate batteries so that I can use my light up mirror, which I will show you in a second so I can have good lighting? Yes. I also ordered sweet green. Uh, it was just a sa uh, Caesar salad. And then I also got some kombucha because we're trying to eat, eat well, we're trying to eat good. So I actually love this kombucha. Pomegranate is my favorite and this one is bomb, but that's the tea. Now it's time to get ready. So you will see me when this is all glammed up. <laughs> Hello vloggy vlog. I have to film something really fast because Okay, let me I just have to hold it I guess. Well, let me just tell you this. So I just drove home. <laughs> I don't even know what time it is. I think it's like oh it's 4 15 a.m. It's Saturday, so I just drove home. I was going to stay at Daisy's house. That's where I've been staying. That's where I've been like filming the other clips that you guys have seen. But I just wanted to get home because the Super Bowl is tomorrow. And I was like, I have church in the morning. And I was like, I just don't know how this is going to like go with like the Super Bowl and all the craziness. But your girl is so tired. But I was just driving home. I was listening to... A Gary Vee podcast and then I was like I really just want to jam to like some Justin Bieber which is so ironic because I just I'm like my brain can't compute that <laughs> why my brain compute anything it's not a computer my brain can't comprehend these are the 4 a.m thoughts like the fact that I just saw him like you guys I when I tell you I was two feet away just like standing there <laughs> my brain just can't compute it and it was just so much fun i hope this literally makes sense because i'm just rambling um but i oh my garage just went dark um anyways so it was so fun drake was like so fun tonight he was awesome it was actually his first performance in like a super long time let me try to wipe my camera it was Drake's first performance in a super long time, but I will have to say between the two, I don't know if I'm just biased, but like my heart is freaking with Jay Biebs. Like seriously, he, I don't know what it is. It could just be like I'm biased because I've been such a huge fan of him since I was literally like 10 years old. I'm pretty sure it's, yeah, it's probably like 10. Anyways, it's probably just that. But also, he's, like, such a... Well, they're both such good entertainers, like, and they're just different. Like, 
it was such a good combo. I also think the interesting thing was with like last night, there was a lot more girls, which I personally prefer other than like, you know, like more males and last, like there was so many guys there tonight. It was crazy. Like there was way more guys than girls where last night, complete opposite. So now I'm like, okay, we just need like Justin Bieber part two. <laughs> We need a Justin Bieber part two, or I'm like trying to think of other artists that are kind of similar to him, where like more girls like him. Anyways, but it was so fun. I hung out with my friend Katie all night tonight, and then I was with a D Rock. I don't know if I actually got any. You know what? He actually got a video, so I will insert that right here. So yeah, we were all hanging out together. It was so fun. I was actually next to them, literally like the whole Drake concert. It didn't even start for like two hours, which you guys will see the clip or maybe you already saw it of us waiting for two hours we were just kind of laughing because we were like there's literally people on earth that don't have clean water and because we were all complaining and i was like like this is pathetic like we can't be complaining about waiting for a singer to sing on a stage when we're at this like dope concert you know what i mean so it's just perspective but anyways for the super bowl tomorrow um, we are, like, doing a small little get-together with some friends. Um, I literally haven't even really thought, like, too much. I, ha I really haven't thought about it actually till now. So, hopefully everything's gonna go well with that. It's nothing too crazy. It's just, like, casual get-together type of thing rather than watching the Super Bowl by yourself. Watch it with some, you know, a bunch of friends. Um, but... I smell like alcohol and no, I didn't drink anything. I don't drink or smoke, but everybody around me was and I don't know if stuff well, I don't I just smell like just substances and I hate I hate that smell. I hate it so much and I hate how it sticks to your hair. When you're a girl, like oh, it's like the worst part about that kind of stuff and I have to shower. Anyways, it's fine. Well I have to wash my hair, I guess. I always shower, but I have to wash my hair. You guys, can you tell? That I'm running off of adrenaline right now. Like, literally, I was singing at the top of my lungs on my way home just now. And my ears are ringing. But it was so sick. Both nights, we were right by the stage. Tonight, I was like, we have to stay by the stage. Like, we have to be up there so early so we can get a good spot. And it was worth it, because we did. And there were so many people that tried to cut it, and I was like, you can't come in here, bro. Like, you can't come in here. That's just, like, it's not how it works. We've been waiting for, it was, I think it was actually over two hours, because we, yeah, it was over two hours, like, yeah, it was, like, two hours, 15 minutes, I think, 20 minutes till he came on, but I have a really funny story, maybe I'll tell it tomorrow, or maybe I'll tell it on stream, I'll just tell you now, forget it, I made a notes on my phone, and I was like, why didn't I think of this before, I made a thing that said, sign me, and then it's had a hundred I put the hundred thieves logo on it and I was holding up my phone because Drake is an investor in hundred thieves he's like a part owner or whatever and I was like I'm just gonna do it because I was like I have zero expectation with this because he's literally performing you know what I mean but I was like one I guess I don't know if he saw it for sure but if he did then that'd be kind of cool like if I ever talk to him one day then it would be kind of like, do you remember that? And he's like, no. And I'm like, well, this happened. I also just kind of wanted to do it so I could tell the story, if anything. Because I just think it's a cool story. And it's kind of like a, just a fun, it's just fun to do stuff like that. That, to push the boundaries of like, if something could somewhat be embarrassing in any way. To just do it. Because at the end of the day, one, everyone's too worried about themselves. So no one actually cares. And two... Who cares? Because life's too short to live with not doing something you want to do. And I felt like it was a good thing to do. I got the idea for it. And I was like, every everything that I feel like if inspiration for anything comes into my mind and it's a good thing, I will do it. It doesn't matter if it's the slightest thing. Like, I'll give you a tiny example. I was just driving on the freeway. Had a feeling that I needed to switch lanes. Guess what? Your girl switched lanes. Don't know why. Don't know if I'll ever know why. But, yeah. I'm going to go inside because I'm just sitting in my garage right now. And I have to walk kind of far and I have to carry all of this stuff in. Hopefully it's like not going to be too crazy. But um, I got so much fun footage. I posted a ton of TikToks. 
it was really fun going live for the whole event too. I'm actually just gonna end the vlog here because I don't know, like I don't really have anything else to do. I'm just gonna go home and go to bed and sleep very well. So I love you guys so much. I hope that you enjoyed this vlog. I'm still getting back to the whole like vlogging thing. So just be patient with me. I'm still learning. Your girl's still getting good with it, but we're gonna get so much better at it. It's gonna be amazing. So if you guys um, liked the video, please make sure to like it. I wanna, tell me what your favorite thing about vlogs is like. Do you just like, when I just talk to the camera and say stuff like this. I wanted to do it right now, even though I know like one the lighting's not the best and I feel and look like a hot mess. But it's everything's so fresh on my brain and I feel like it's fun because I just left the event literally an hour ago. So it's kind of fun when you can like see it like happening right then, you know what I mean? Um but yeah. Anyways, I would love to hear what you guys like, though, about the vlogs and what you want to see more of. Like, if you just want to do, like, if I'm going grocery shopping, like, do you want to come grocery shopping with me and we can just, like, chat or whatever. Um, and yeah, if you're not subbed, then just subscribe, support, support the TK fam, help us get to 6,000 subs here on the vlog channel. And I will see you on my Instagram, my TikToks, and you you know the drill. But all the links for everything is in the description. And I wanted to say thank you to Revolve for such a freaking dope weekend. Like, seriously, this was so much fun. I met so many cool people. I also got to meet Faze Banks. Don't know if he even, like, remembers my name because it was so loud. I don't know if he heard it. Actually, I think, wait, he know because he asked me again for it later that night. So maybe, who knows? Faze Tara Kelly, don't know. 100 Thieves Tara Kelly, don't know. We shall see what happens one day. Either way, everything happens for a reason. And I'm just freaking along for the ride. But I am very proud of myself because I, like, went up to a lot of people. And I, yeah, it was really fun. So, I love talking to people. And sometimes you get social anxiety and sometimes you just grow balls and you get over it. You know what I mean? So... <laughs> <laughs> okay, I love you guys. TKFM forever. Don't you ever forget it. Also, I just realized this clip is literally 10 minutes long, just of me straight talking. And I don't think I'm going to edit it really too much at all. So, see ya. Bye. <laughs>